I love this fight right here. It's better than the Logan Paul Mayweather fight. This one right here is realistic. There are no rules. You hear what I'm saying to you? There are no rules. What's happening, foodie fam? You've been waiting for it, and I'm bringing it to you, the spicy edition. Now, fun fact. Back in 2017, Burger King purchased Popeyes for $1.8 billy. So silly. So my expectation was Burger King's chicken sandwich should really be the only contender for Popeyes because at the end of the day, they're both laying in bed together. However, however, as we all know, there could only be one MVP, most valuable player. Sit back, relax, and comfortable because right after the trailer for my new Netflix show, we're going to get up off into this thing something proper. As for the trailer, roll it. Coming this Wednesday, June 9th, only on Netflix. freshness of the salmon is what really brings you in. It's saying you just bit into something magnificent. I started doing food reviews in my car around 2009, and then my life changed. I'll go just about anywhere to get some good food. I'm only here for one reason and one reason only. That is to devour. That's looking real good right there. Every bite has to be an experience. And I'm gonna take you for that experience. You too. Mm. I'm the captain now. You know I'm not leaving until I tell you what my favorite fried food in the city ooh, is. Ooh, ooh. It hits all the spots. What I'm looking for is some good chicken and waffles. Let me tell you about this chicken. Mommy, chicken dry? It's dry, we don't want it. So you talking juicy, juicy? It's got to be juicy. Is this what you do? I mean, this is what do we do? Boom, boom, all over the place. Boom, boom, in my face. It's the most decadent burger that we have ever made. Starts with one pound of Wagyu on there, truffle cheese, gold, billionaire bacon on top, big lobster, yeah. gold dusted bun. It is the best burger you will ever have. You need a burger to have in a moment. All right, enjoy your burger. All I need for you to do for me is keep it crispy. I had to kiss it. I had to kiss it. Just give me a moment. I have moments with my food. I Just... love you, man. This is fresh, fried, and crispy. You want to know why I call it a hush puppy? Did you hear me say anything while I was chewing it? Hush puppy. Now, don't mind the growl of the whip. It's a little hot outside, about 97 degrees, and the boy, I'm pretty big. I need a little bit of AC in my life, so the AC is on. Hope y'all don't mind. But dang, as you notice, as far as the rapper, BK didn't go too far away. They didn't stray far from Popeyes. White and orange, mm-hmm. Thick, 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 because they both feel thick. They heavy. They heavy player. And on top of that, they're both happen to be inside of that heat-sealed wrapper to keep the chicken and the sandwich itself nice and warm. Now, let's open these things up and see what they hit on. All right, y'all. We're going to notice a little bit difference here. We do have the chicken sandwich diaper around the chicken sandwich itself. So, you can go ahead and pick it up, not make much of a mess on yourself. This is the Popeye's edition. You see that love right there that's that sba soft bun action with peninsula running through it let's drop the top on the convertible bottle look, look how soft that is dang boo dang boo okay you got that spicy sauce all up on the brioche bun that thing look buttery don't it, it look wild buttery crazy soft you have spicy sauce all over the popeye's chicken now hold up hold up let me lift up the chicken oh to expose Two Ickle Pickles popping on a handstand as per always with more spicy sauce at the base, another soft brioche bun, and it's ready for consumption. Now, let's uh, put some work in on the Burger King version over here. And this version was a little more expensive than Popeye's. As we know, BK's is more falling into the, the $5 holla. I got beaten ahead for $5.79. Now we have sauces running away on the spicy sauce right here all up on the wrapper. So this one's a little messy, 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 ugh. Woo, a little bit harder, but still soft bun action. Drop the top on the convertible box there. And we have what looks to be the Burger King sauce. I didn't switch it over to Hellman's Mayo. I wanna leave it as is so I could do this thing properly. We have two of those deli pickles popping on the handstand. More the Burger King sauce along with their spicy sauce mixed in. So that should already tell me we're having a little more flavor packing. And again, 
that chicken. That chicken looked like it's about to be a problem in these streets, right? Bong. More of the BK sauce with spicy sauce at the bottom. This is going to be messy. Sheesh. I wish I brought my Dame Drops Ghetto Bib. I have it in the other vehicle. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. I'm already making a mess of myself, y'all. Sheesh, boo. You messy. Messy, messy. Come here. Come here. Come love me. Come love me. Oh, you messy, messy, boo. Jeez. All right, y'all. You see, come on. You see for what it is. Look, look, look. That's that BK loving on a spicy chicken sandwich. And we know the spiciness only provides nothing but extra flavor, right? Oof. Let's see what that thing hitting on, though. Mm, come here. Oh, you have a little burn to you, baby. She's Louise. Family, can I talk to y'all? This thing right here is spicy. Spy, like, there's heat that's been packed in on the Burger King spicy chicken sandwich. There's the type of heat that makes you respect the bite. It said, put some respect on my name. It's crispy. It has crunch and munch for lunch. A little bit of chicken on that. Not a lot of chicken, just a little bit of chicken on that. The pickles playing their part with flavor. But this time, the Burger King sauce complements the spicy sauce. They go perfect together. By itself, I prefer Hellman's. But when you have the Burger King sauce with their spicy sauce on the spicy edition, family, you are forced to respect it. You are forced to love it. It actually tastes good. Burger King. I can't stunt, BK, when I say your chicken sandwich would be a perfect five all day banger had it a little more chicken on the inside. I mean, that's good for what it is. But in a chicken sandwich war, Popeye come with dumb thick chicken. Your chicken been working out. It's strong. It's crisp. It makes you put respect on its name. It says you in great shape. You have the chicken, so you have the gym rat of the chicken sandwich game. The gym rat. The gym hustler. The person in the gym working it out, busting it out, working it out, busting it out. That's what you have. Popeyes, come here, Popeyes. <clears throat> oh my goodness, why? Why are you giving me so much trouble? Why? Come here, I said. Come and get over here. Get over, get over here. Bring your sexy self to me. <clears throat> get over here. Now, this is why Popeyes reign supreme in the chicken sandwich game. Let me put this down. I ain't want to hold that no more. I ain't want to hold that no more. Hold yourself. Hold yourself, camera. Because you got to give the reigning champion the respect the reigning champion deserves. Look at the chicken. I said, look at the chicken. You see the spicy sauce on that chicken, don't you? You can barely see the ickle pickle popping on the handstand, can't you? You see the brioche bun. Egg bun at the end of the day, but it's brioche. It is buttery. It is loved up with flavor. It is everything. Ah. Oh. Oh. Ah. Hmm. Now that crisp is light. It's a light crisp gone easy on the gristle leaving nothing behind but pure thick juicy tender chicken mm. Mm. Yeah.
Mm. Need I say it? Now that is a chicken sandwich, y'all. Ladies and gentlemen, it's obvious who the champion is. Now, Burger King, you came with all the flavor, all the crunch and munch for lunch. You provide more crunch, you have a lot of bite. You just don't have enough chicken for your boy. You have good chicken, you do, just not enough chicken. Popeyes comes through with a thick bite, light on the exterior body. You're, you're Burger King, you're heavier on your exterior body. This has a lot of spice on here, which is great. It is great, it adds so much kick to the sandwich. I love it, you're a four and a half. Popeyes is a 10, my friend, a 20 on the money, a 100 running. It doesn't even get to fit on the one to five Richter scale at all. When you look at them stacked together, all you see is the Popeyes chicken sandwich. That's all you see. Popeyes stands tall with its chest out. The chesticle is out. The hamburger meat on the chesticle is popping with a little bit of Jerry Curl juice, if you will. Now, BK has a savory sauce. It is, it's savory. It's okay. I don't like it by itself. It might be Grey Poupon, I don't know, I don't know. But the pickles work on both sandwiches. The soft, fresh buns are amazing on both sandwiches. You can see how hard Burger King goes with the spice. You can, in the reddish tint, the reddish tint on the chicken, Burger King went dummy on the spice, right? Popeyes didn't go dummy on the spice. They gave you enough spice for you to handle on the mild side. Burger King's gonna give you a little more heat. If you need a little more heat, you go to BK. BK owns Popeyes. So basically in the chicken game, you can't honestly go wrong. They're two great bites, two great contenders. This was a beautiful fight. I love this fight right here. It's better than the Logan Paul Mayweather fight. This one right here is realistic. There are no rules. You hear what I'm saying to you? There are no rules. Right now, Burger King is number two in the chicken sandwich game. Yes, smacking the flavor off of Chick-fil-A. Beating the brakes off of Chick-fil-A. Burger King does that. You're number two, BK. Popeyes is still number one. Now listen, y'all. Listen. My show, Fresh Fried and Crispy on Netflix, airs June 9th, this Wednesday. I'm throwing a watch party in the casino at Comics Roadhouse. You're all invited. 8 p.m. You're all invited. I want to let you know I'm not filming a lot this week because your boy got to go out to L.A. I got some more business to handle. It's going to be crazy. But when I get there, I'm going to do a chicken sandwich that I didn't have an opportunity to do out here in Connecticut. I'm going to try to find the Zaxby's I've been hearing so much about. Zaxby's will go up against Popeye's if I find it wherever I may be. I'm going to give them a fair shot, a fair chance. But right now, nobody's taking and dethroning Popeye's. You see it, and I said it. You see it, and I said it. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> shit.